we went to El Nido for, for the first time in like 2004. My love for nature really started from there. When you're submerged underwater, you just feel so immersed in the world and connected to all the other animals around you and I feel like that's really important and it's really special. So pa sa paglaki ko sa bataan, naranasan kong lumangoy kasama ng mga isda, naranasan kong makakita ng mga corals. Dahil nga na-experience ko siya first hand, meron akong responsibility na pangalagaan yun for the people. Mahalaga ang pangangalaga natin sa ating kalikasan at sa mga habitat sapagkat dito na salalay ang survival ng mga tao na nakatira dito. Ang bawat bagay na may buhay sa ating planeta at lahat tayo ay konektado sa isa't isa. I feel like there's a common misconception that saving the environment and being sustainable means having very little possessions. Like, it's important to strike a balance, buying as many products as you like that are sustainable and work in harmony with the environment instead of being detrimental towards it. Sa mga kabataang katulad ko, tigawin sana nilang lifestyle or gawin nilang kultura para sa kanila ang pangalaga sa kalikasan. Without um, activism from the youth, there are no proper stewards of the environment to carry, carry forward the proper sustainable living that we always talk about but not always follow through with. Everyone has an activist within them, but a lot of people are just bystanders because they don't have a platform to. And WWF helped me become an active initiator of change.